now in these senior, senior two-year-olds, could our junior winners please take a step forward? In second place in the junior show, entry 871, Gold Mine EBR Kira 195 EXP, shown by Alexis Williams of Mabel, Minnesota. And the winning junior, and also the production award winner, entry 885, PD Presto Don't Be Jealous, shown by Tucker Peterson of Mountain Grove, Missouri. At one year, 10 months of age, 305 days, she produced 18,855 pounds of milk, 3.4% fat with 634 pounds of fat, 3.3% protein with 629 pounds of protein. Second place in the class goes to Lazy M Liriano Alley EXP. She's also best bred and owned the entry of Lazy M Farm LLC, Michael and Herman Meyer, Stitzer, Wisconsin. The winning entry and best Brennan owned is entry 881, Hardcore Premium Fire Made EXP, shown by Peter Vale, Hill Point Partners, and Frank and Diane Borba, Valatee, New York. Congratulations. Judge Shop, your comments. Just another terrific uh, two year old class in our Milk and Shorthorn show. Uh, we got a cow that quite handily come to the top of the class for us. She's a cow who's so stylish. You admire the uphill run, a tremendous frame, and a cow that walks on an exceptional set of feet and legs. And she also is our best stutter cow in the class. You love the definition of steam. You love the snugness attachment she has. But what a beautiful frame on this cow. And that style and that balance goes ahead of the cow and coming out in second. Another second place cow, you admire the frame on this cow, the white cow. You admire the depth, the openness of rib that she has, the snugness attachment she has. She's just not as neat about them teeth setting today as our first prize cow. She's also not as clean in the thigh today as our first prize cow, and she's not as also long today. But she comes over the cow in third. When you get behind her, she has so much more height than width at the top of the rear rudder today. Also, I'm going to advance, she's so much more stronger in her loin today. Also, I'm going to advance, she has a little more depth of fore rib today as well. You admire the third prize cow with that sharpness and dariness, the angularity that she has. She goes ahead of the cow coming out in fourth. The cow in fourth, I think, you know, has the next 60 days is just going to be crucial for her. You admire this cow. She is a second KF senior two-year-old. She's fresh 45 days. A cow that you admire the hardness across the top that she has. Just like to give her a little more time to get a little more openness of rear rib today. Also give her a little more height at the top of the rear rib today to compete, compete with our first three cows. But she does have that advantage over our fifth place cow. On she snugger in her four other attachment today. Also, I'm giving her advantage, she got a little more width throughout. This fifth prize cow, when you get behind her, you admire this rear rudder. She's got that definition of seam. She's sharp, she's dairy, she's angular. And she has that advantage over our sixth prize cow. She's a little more depth and openness, especially in the uh, rear rib today. You admire this sixth prize cow with that straightness of lines that she has. Just a cow, I just like to see her a little sharper and cleaner. But most of all, give her a little more definition of seam at the top of the rear rudder today to get her any higher in the class. She has an advantage over our seventh prize cow, just recently fresh here, a second caver. Just so much more level from hooks to bins today. Also snugger in her attachments all the way through, but a nice group of cows all the way down. 